Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for August 30th, 2021. So let's take that weekly, which had big messages in it. Please make sure that you go back and check it out. And honestly, this isn't even a marketing thing. If you like the message, make sure you like the video and subscribe. The more you do that, the more the message can get out, okay? Yeah, it helps my channel, but I don't even care about that at this point. People need to start thinking, okay? Shield yourself because there's stuff to come. Archangel Michael, I ask you to protect me, my loved ones, my vehicle, and my home with your powerful shield. Surround us in your purple light, which allows only pure love to penetrate. Please stay with me day and night. Keep my loved ones safe, and then you can name your loved ones. I'm telling you, there, there's more to come. This is just the beginning. And uh, as I mentioned in the weekly, there could be some things happening in America, anywhere really, but um, for me, I'm an American, so I, I just feel like it's very, very close, incredibly close. That's why, um, I don't know, I just, and I felt um, evacuation, but a, an evacuation of my area, I'm in Colorado Springs, so uh, I, I mean, could it be wildfire? Sure. Could it be a flood? Sure. Could it be the military bases having to, I don't know, evacuate or something? I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm, as a human, not allowing myself to go there. Um, but I just, I just felt like my area being evacuated. So when we say shield yourself, this isn't so you go into panic mode, victimhood, and you say, oh, no, I can't with this world. When am I just going to have the love of my life? And all that money and you can have any of that anytime you want <laughs> but it really is all hands on deck when it comes to energy work and that's what i was really trying to get at in the weekly as well so if you can see what you can do to um you know i'm feeling like morning ritual if you don't already put the world in your morning ritual maybe try that out um putting love out there to especially children innocent people uh, if you have somebody that you have been at odds with. Now, I've done this uh, exercise before where I felt, and if you're an empath, you feel this a lot, where there is kind of an energy drain. Now, in my case, it was some unresolved traumas. I'm still working through those. I'm sure I'll be working through those for years. It's not something that you just easily let go of. But um, there were specific people that I just always, in my head, said they're evil. And what they did was evil. Okay, uh, again, it had to do with gossip and basically shoving me out of a workplace and making it impossible for me to even make a living there. It was bad. It was very abusive and very bad. But what I did was I did a meditation and part of the clearing was a soul retrieval type thing. In the meditation, I took out sort of their thought forms and their definition of me and the effects of the abuse. And, um, and I don't throw that word around lightly. I'm not joking. This place was insane, okay? But even my bitterness, my resentment that you just saw right there, <laughs> you know, any of that, it was really amplified. I took all those thought forms out and then I did a shielding, okay? So shield, uh, you know, uh, shield yourself for protection. And um, I, I asked that no harm come to the people that harmed me. That's important. Watch your intention. Didn't want any harm to come to them but I did ask for the truth to be revealed. So there could be a settling of this, you know, negative energy. So think of it as an extraction, <laughs> okay? So people can see where the poison is. For one, they don't get to anybody else. And for two, when someone's getting away with something and we're being an enabler, it's not about punishment. Again, that person might continue to victimize others or those people might continue to victimize others. But they can also start really getting to other people, to good people and changing their minds. Okay? So that poison starts sort of infiltrating and now it's collectively lowering the energy. So you might want to do something like that. That's why I'm offering that example to you. You do whatever you feel is right for you. We're going to leave it there. I'm sending you so much love and take care.